How they got it set up. Yeah, it's at the bottom. Sales over the end line. I can't wait till this boy get in love. I cannot wait till this boy fall in love. Ooh, can't wait. No, nah, I just, I just, no, nah, I just know how it go, how you think it go. On first down, Newton. He's got it to James White. And they nearly get this all the way to midfield. Mark him down at the 49. And I think that's a pretty good illustration of why they try to get the football into his hands out of the backfield. That was something else. Yeah. They talk so much from a defensive perspective about scheming and finding ways to take away the run. That means the offense has to devise different ways to get the ball in the hands of their guy out of the backfield. Find open space, let him run, and big things can happen. Okay. And they did right there. So one play, and they're already just shy of midfield. The shotgun snap for Newton. Open man is Jacob Hollister. And he is tackled inside the 40, not quite to the 35. 14 yards is the pickup there in a New England first down. Pretty good start there on plays one and two. And not discriminating at You're all. You're off that game. Spreading it around on the first two throws of the game. Two different parts of the field as well. On first and ten, Newton. All hit as he throws there incomplete. You're going to see how serious she is. When she's serious, you're going to get up. Second down. But you go downs on this drive, but getting the incompletion there, that should give them something to build on and maybe turn the tide. And it's better in the long run. Line of scrimmage again the 37 as they line up second and ten. They fake the give. Newton. Flushed out right. And he's taken down, trying to do a little too much, getting outside of the pocket, and it results in a sack. And Daniil Hunter, he's the one who gets in there and brings him down to the ground. So now after the sack, Cam of the Patriots going to look up at a third and long. Now the Dolphins are going to halt the action here. It's a timeout. They'll have two remaining as we step aside here in this first quarter. Dolphins bring on an extra defensive back on third down. Now Newton. The Dolphins do the job defensively there, and now it brings up fourth. Well, they've got man coverage on the outside, and my scouting report on these DBs tells me that they love to take matters in their own hands. They want man coverage, not zone. And there was good coverage there that forced the incompletion. And the putter Bailey on now as he mm -hmm. sends this one away. And that's a work of art right there. Out of bounds at the two-yard line. Excellent placement. And off that bounce, Charles, I didn't know where it was going to go. It can be an inexact science as to where they place it, but they say the two-yard line. Yeah, I don't know how they really determined that. And let's face it, at the end of that play, one side's going to be happy. The other team's going to be unhappy. So, what do they do, shorten the hypotenuse? I mean, how do they figure that out? You know that stuff. You're the smart guy. Oh, that's you, partner. <laughs> Oh. And he will forge his way forward only up to the 
two-yard line. Just a yard on the pickup there, and it'll bring up a second and nine. Well, not a game that you're going to go crazy about, but when you start at your own two-yard line, any type <laughs> of space is good for the offensive guys. Yeah, you just can't go backwards from here. They did it. Now we'll see if they can keep it on schedule here on second down. Here's second and nine, just a yard on that last run. It's Tongue of Iloa from his own end zone. That's caught by his big tight end, Mike Kosicki. And he gets it up to the 10-yard line here. The reception good for seven. It's third down. Third down. up on the ground with Breda. He gets it forward for four, maybe five, but the flags fly. And this one could be coming back. An extra corner comes on now for the Patriots. D on third down. From the gun. It's Tua. That's complete to his tight end, Mike Kosicki. And he is going to have the Dolphins first down as they're able to get the third down conversion. Tua finding Kosicki there for a Dolphin first. So that last play gives him a little more space now. Here's first and 10 at the 16-yard line. Now a play fake. Here's Tonga Bailoa. And he fires one yeah. that's intercepted. Picked off by Patrick Chung. Terrific return there. They're finally able to crowd him down near the 11-yard line. That's not one that he's going to want to remember, but he had to get it out of the way at some point. His first career interception. And if he's the guy that they think he is, he's not laughing it off, but he's also not going to let it affect him as the game proceeds. He's going to go back out there, still be the same confident kid, the reason that they drafted him, and go out and play. Reception. Here's Newton. And this is caught. It's Edelman. And he's able to get this down to the five yard oh, you line dress. before he's out of bounds. They get the guard out of Georgia mm -hmm. Tech, Shaq Mason. Why can't you? Oh. Again. Pretty much try to tell Jameer he ain't never saying that because I want to leave him. Jameer's like, that's a lie. Because you told me my mama you would come around summer and you didn't go. <laughs> he was like, I saw my mama tell me you could come. So following the hold, they're in a bit of a hole here with a first and 20. From the gun, here's Newton. Throwing middle, but it's incomplete. James White, the man he was looking for out of the backfield. And that'll bring up second down. down. I think we can all understand what they're thinking mm. right now. They take over the ball. You can feel it up and we're in the prison. Right so they've got that in their hip pocket. It's just too much room. It was just too much stuff in there at the time. And turn this into bigger points. Their thinking is a touchdown is really what they mm. should get. Starting here. Okay. Getting three points at the end of this okay. drive. That would feel disappointing. Cam fighting. He lost the football. It's out. But I think the Patriots are going to hang on to the football. They do. They get it back. Look, it's already ordered in there. That's all right. Look where they recovered it. That's a big loss. A lot of bad news on that play for them, wasn't there? Lost the football. Lost a lot of yardage. But I think the good news outweighs it. Able to retain possession. That was big for them. 
So danger averted for the moment, but now here's a third and long. Now a play fake, and it's Newton. And he fires to Edelman, complete on the comebacker. And on this one, he'll get to the 15, right at the 15-yard line. Despite a pickup of 16, they're still well short of the sticks on fourth. And the 12-year veteran knocks it right through. And the Patriots jump out to a 3-0 lead. They got the interception, but very little movement. <laughs> Him to settle for three, and it, it does feel like settling when that happens, doesn't it? It certainly does, what? but we got to give a lot of credit where it's due, and that's to the defense because they ran onto the field. This one called sudden change, right? What are you talking about? Take oh lord, that'll be taken about a yard deep. <laughs> Tackled at the 21-yard line, so a net negative there of four yards. TikTok, oh my goodness. It ain't nothing but when you change a bunch of outfits. And I brought this little number and pulled in the wire wrap. <laughs> the Dolphins at the line ready for their next drive. They threw an interception the first time they had the football, only gave up three points off of that, so it shouldn't be a difficult hole to overcome. It really shouldn't, as long as they're not listening to the chatter coming from the other side, because when you throw a pick, look, I know defensive backs, they have a tendency to be a little bit loud after they take one away, but they also have a tendency to gamble a little bit more, thinking they'll get a second one. Maybe they can take advantage of that with some double moves. On first down, here's Brito. Not much there. Maybe a couple up to the 35. The last run good for two. Here's second and eight. Well, any lane that might have been open there was closed pretty quickly, and that was because the defensive front, they won that battle at the point of attack at the line of scrimmage. They used great leverage, held their spot, and stacked him up. Mm -hmm. So the failure to connect on second down, that leaves him staring up here at a third and eight. Now the defense going to use the first of their timeouts. They'll have two remaining as we step aside here in this first quarter. An incomplete pass on that last play, and that means they'll need to come up with something here on third down. Tug of Iloa working out of the gun. He's got a man complete. And he is going to have the Dolphins first down as they're able to get the third down conversion. A big play there for the Dolphins. 37 yards. First down. So into Pat's territory now. Here's first and 10 as they're down to the 29-yard line. 3 nothing after one on EA Sports. Tua going to hand this one to Burita. Might have gotten this one down to the 28, and that's all. Lawrence Guy able to bring him down. Well, they didn't get a whole lot out of that one, but I think you've got to continue to try and run and try and keep the defense honest. You mean, or also just sit back, dare you to throw it on every down. Oh. Yeah, you get your quarterback hit a lot that way, too. Tongue of Iloa to throw on second down here. Able to find Shaheen here. Well, that was an okay hook up there with his tight end, but unfortunately, they didn't get the kind of yards they had hoped for. That's going to bring up third down. Throwing his tongue of Iloa on third down here. And it's caught by Parker. And they'll get this down to the 10. First catch of the new season for him, and he picks up the first. Nice snag by Devontae Parker. While it took him five years in the league to have his first 1,000 yard season, he broke out in a big <laughs> way. The former first round pick had clear highs across the board in 2019. In fact, his touchdown total for the year equaled his career total to date. So they hit pay dirt, but don't count it yet. There's laundry on the field. We'll see what the penalty flag is about. A costly penalty there. A lineman got downfield. And from the if I give you a hundred, how much points. I get back? Bit a hundred. <laughs> <laughs> Complete. And he's 
pass brought down just outside of the 10 at the 11. Three yards the game there, second down. One thing you're hoping for when you run drag routes, you're able to hit a receiver in stride, and he can pick up a lot of yardage after the catch. But in this situation, the defense was effective, able to stop him before he could get a good head of steam going. And he's going to be brought down. Yeah, but you, the, 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 yeah, but you got to put in a lot of money to get anything back from a big company. This time they double it and pick up six. Decided to hand it off that time on the run pass option. Appeared to be an easy decision. Just gave it inside. Nice steady Just game. Like, a big play if you think about it. Just like you see all this Bitcoin stuff. See all this Bitcoin stuff? You need to put in that amount of money to make some money. How much is the other one up, Unleash? I know it's steadily growing. Yeah. As I said, it's going to be steady. It's going to be steady. It's going to be steady. First down as they begin the drive. And last time able to get three. Is that what they wanted? They wanted six, but they got at least something. They mustered something out of the drive. They'll take it. Just I, I like the way you, you, you've described it. Not ideal, but they'll take it. Anything to put some points on the board. But this time on offense, they don't even want to see the field goal kicker trot on the field. <laughs> they want that ball in the end zone. Yeah, they'll be going for six. Play action. It's Newton. Eluding the pressure right. Now he'll let it go deep. Well, this is taken in. It's complete. Yeah, he's going to be out of bounds, but not before he takes it inside the 40. They'll get 34 yards there. I know we love our jobs, and pretty much any play we see, we're pretty, you know, excited about. The big plays, let's face it, that's what we absolutely live for. How about that one? That was great. And what our camera missed was the fist pump from the sideline after that catch. They're fired out. That's a big game. And he's going to go down. Back near midfield at the 49. But just not much a quarterback can do there, CD. The pressure was in his face almost instantaneously. Led to a very quick sack. Yeah, this time it's going to come from the middle linebacker because watching the lineman, it seemed to me that they thought he was going to drop back into pass protection, but he surprised them and came on the blitz instead and had a pretty clear run to the quarterback. As we check the next-gen stats, you'll see he had precious little time to do anything with the football there. Throwing on second and long. Newton. He'll get this into the hands of Bird. Yeah, he is out of bounds but not before he's inside the 30. A first down there on a pickup of 25. They'll run it here. This is James White. And able to break one tackle, but then quickly brought down. But a nice little gain. Another good gain. That's now 35 yards combined on those last two plays. Still a few inches short of a first down as they come up now on second down. Going on the ground, it's White. Four yards, the pick up, first down. Now that's the way to do it. Handed to someone with vision and good footwork, and they added a little bit of power, and you find a way to pick up first downs. This offense finding its legs now. Here's another first and 10. Now 
it's Newton here off the bootleg. Steps away, and he'll take it into the end zone for a Patriot touchdown. A 12-yard touchdown run, and the Patriots have taken the lead. And we mentioned before, Cam, the all-time leader in rushing TDs by a quarterback, so everyone he gets from here on out for the rest of his career, just adding to that lead. So what you're saying is that if you're a young kid who wants to play quarterback in the NFL, and that's the record you're shooting for, good luck. You got some work to do, aren't you? <laughs> by the time he's done, he might have double a second-place guy. And only able to get this to the 19, so probably should have opted for the touchback. At their own 19 yard line. The Dolphins at the line ready for their next drive. And what do you think goes on here in this situation? If you got the football, you're trailing, you're back in your own territory with just a little time. Do you try something? You're thinking about jump starting your team. Right? You just mentioned it. They're down. They're trying to get back into the game. But you've got to figure if something goes wrong, you may have put yourself in a spot where you may not be able to come back in the second half. Managing risk is a big decision here. Let's it fly for Thielen. It got his man complete. And he is out of bounds inside the 35. An excellent pickup of 34 yards. There's the arm strength that we saw in college and during the scouting process. And really, it's not just the arm strength there, but the placement as well. To me, that was an excellent combination of arm talent and accuracy. Now the Patriots will use the second of their timeouts as they'll stop it with just over 40 seconds to go in the first half. So the big play changes the complexion of things. Here's first and 10, just outside the 30. On play action, here's Tua. And he just gets rid of it, throws it away. A wise move there, looked like nobody opened, now second down. Well, the incompletion, yes, but maybe here not the worst thing in the world? No, not on first and 10. Actually gives them a chance to regroup. Relax just a little bit. They huddle up, talk it over. Then they get a chance to continue their drive. From the 34, they'll come to the line on second and 10. And again, it's Tunga Bailoa. Got a man, and he hits him in stride. And they'll have it in the red zone before he crosses over out of bounds. Well, that certainly has to feel good. It's not all the time that the play caller should get all the credit. Sometimes I think in the huddle, the quarterback just says, hey, who's going to make a play for me? I just need something right here. And the end result there, nice first down. Draw keeps moving. From the red zone now, they'll look to throw. It's complete to Parker, left side. And able to break one tackle, but then quickly brought down. But a nice little gain. Now the Dolphins will use the last of their timeouts as the clock will stop with 21 seconds to go here in the first half. Again, they will throw it with Tunga Bailoa. And he's got his tight end, Gesicki, in the end zone. Touchdown, Dolphins. Get it! Mike Gesicki as the first half is winding down. And the Dolphins are an extra point away from tying up this football game. Jason Sanders now for the extra point. And he'll put it through, and that evens us up at 10 apiece. All level now at 10 apiece as the kick's away. And no return on this one as the fair catch is signaled for and taken. The Patriots take over first and 10 at their own 25-yard line.
The Pats at the line, ready to go. And with time quickly fading here in the second quarter, not sure how aggressively, offensively, they want to play this. I think we'll find out just how much they trust their guys in this situation if they decide to take a shot. Catch is made by Herring. Now a signal and a timeout call. As it comes with nine seconds to go in this first half of play. First and ten at the 49-yard line. down it's Newton throw caught here by Bird and he'll be out just a yard or two shy of the 30 that's over 40 yards of movement with those last two plays so with four seconds to go in the half here's the field goal unit onto the field he hit his first now this one from 48 yards away and folks kick is good and that will do it for this first half so we've reached halftime here on opening weekend as we'll get you down the coast to Orlando for Jonathan Coachman at REA Sports Halftime Report. Coach, we'll see if week one fatigue becomes any kind of a factor as we are back underway in the second half. And a nice return sets him up pretty good here right at the 30-yard line. Their own 30 yard <laughs> 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 that was so cute. One was chocolate, one was the Dolphins really at the line ready for their next drive. Oh, and they're hoping to redo their efforts of the last drive oh, when they got into the end zone. And just think of what it's like now on the sideline. Because when you score a touchdown, you have to go up and look at the tablet and see what you did on the last drive. When you score points, it's a whole lot better view than when you're trying to figure out how to fix things there. Now the result here, a pickup of eight. Leaves him with two to go on second down. Oh, I see Mike Gusecki make a catch. I'm reminded of his athletic ability. And going back to the time we were leading up to the draft and showing his career highlights, including high school volleyball, where he appeared he was almost jumping over the net. I expect him to continue to grow in 2020 and start to make progress in 2019. Five touchdown catches and 570 total yards. Did you see him on stage? Last year? Uh -huh. It's really incompletion uh -huh. here now. Third and two. Now two. They'll get this into the hands of Burita. And he'll work it across midfield inside the 45. And good for 19 yards as they pick up the conversion on third. So into Pat's territory now. Here's first and 10 at the 43. <laughs> Tua setting up shop to throw again. On the right side open is Gasecki. That catch good for only a couple. Very able to convert that into much, but it's never a bad idea to try to get the ball into a tight end of his caliber's hands and see what kind of disruption he can cause. So second and eight here after the pass play for two yards on first down. Tua to throw again. The ball popped in the air and intercepted. Picked off by the old pro, Stephon Gilmore. And they will set up shop at their own 41 yard line. The first half did not go their way, and that's not going to make matters at all. An interception here on the opening drive. The Obviously, not what they were striving to accomplish. But you know who's really upset on their team? The defense. Already trailing. They're going to be counted on to try and hold that score at least where it is. 
That one good for 10 yards. And that'll bring up a second in just about a few inches here. Something to watch here in week one of the season, tackling. Because you and I both know that in the preseason, a lot of these guys don't play a whole lot. Plus the intensity and the speed really ratchets up on opening week. And he is tackled inside the 40, not quite to the 35. A gain of 13, it's a first down. Well, you certainly have to give a little credit here because they're playing this game now Yo. at their pace. This is ball control football, sustained runs, taking their time. Uh, you ain't had one yet, I'm going to just tell you that much. First down, here's White. Good, bro. Just what you want on a first down run. <laughs> Call it eight yards, and it's second and two. Good strong All right. against the three, four, All seven, right. Three, Don't four, get one till I take you. Seven yards there at a first down. I was better than you. I crossed you up at five years old, right? King of Pressure. They defer to White out of the shotgun. What? It's not. Yeah, King of Pressure. So they really got zero benefit at all, right? Sometimes you can absorb a penalty when you get a big return. Then the penalty brings it back, but you still have great field position. As you pointed out, not in this case. And he's brought down, but not before they get it across the 20-yard line. That'll be a pickup of 10 as they try to recover from this 10-point deficit. First down, Dolphins. First down, Tonga by Loa. And seeing no options, he just tosses this one away incomplete. And now that'll bring up second down. You know, despite the score line, I think they've got to like where they are here. They're on the road and just one big play away from getting right back in this game. I'm gonna follow right along with you because the spot they're in now is a credit to their defense. They've kept them in it by making the plays that they've made. And that just means one big score away from being right back there. Now the question is, can this offense step up and make that play? Because that's been an issue for them in this game. 11 yards there, first down. And the Dolphin first down. Let's it fly for Thielen. And that's caught inside the 35. And all the way down inside the 25 before he gets out of bounds. Obviously, they're not where they want to be right now on the scoreboard. Big plays like that, though, that'll trend them in the right direction. Yeah, a few more like that, they'll be right back in the game. And if they can continue to do that, maybe they'll inspire their defense as well to get a few stops. Two and now on first down. 
His throw caught at about the five. And they will eventually get him down, but he's inside the five all the way to the three. And a nice gain of 21 yards. Two big plays in succession. Not sure this D knows what hit him, but now they got to get ready. It's first and goal. Back now in Foxborough. It's Dolphin football, but they trail here as we get set for the fourth. They'll try to run with Breda. And this one will wind up with him losing yards. <laughs> no, you ain't. The four yard line. A loss of two there. Second down. From the gun, it's Tua. And that is caught. Touchdown, Miami. Adam Thielen. There to make the grab. There you go. Being annoying. We didn't have a handshake today. Jeez. I didn't even do anything. It's all about timing there on that short slant, Charles. Exactly right. That was timed up so well. The route, the throw, touchdown. Extra point up and good by Sanders. And now things get a bit more interesting here in this fourth quarter. Boy, Africa, Africa, boy, you gotta know what you gotta know what country you in. Who going to war with who? I, anything, boy. They just come through bussing. Them boys coming through bussing, boy. They ain't even finna ask no questions. Kids and all. about what they're trying to get done because they're down so they obviously need the football need a score but they can't be so aggressive as to give up their edge their gaps and have the offense hit them with a big play that's a tough way to go out boy spare That shit gonna be in your neck. You can be like, this some bullshit. <laughs> Nigga just gonna die. Like, his last words gonna be, man, this is some bullshit. Yeah. All this shit, I done dodged at home and I got to come to worry about the goddamn. A spear? You don't want to go to them. I, I, boy, listen. I don't want to go to jail over here. I don't want to go to jail over here. I know I don't want to go over there. They ain't even got food to feed regular folks. They got clean water, regular food, boy, listen here. And you don't know what they say. Everything, everything Africans say to you, you think they want to fight. <laughs> well, everything they say, all fast and all that. Like, bro, oh, bro. <laughs> okay. Everything they say, they sound angry, boy. I'm straight. Like, bro, you don't know what he just said. Nigga, ready to fight, though. But when you're running a drag route, something short, shallow, going through defenders, using guys almost as. Javante Parker! And all the way in for a Miami touchdown. Javante Parker, 59 yards. And the Dolphins are going to jump back in front. 
There it is, partner. You see it. Four <laughs> fingers. What does that mean? Fingers. That, four, that signifies the fourth quarters here. That's right. Who's going to dominate? Usually both teams are holding them up. We you seen that movie, four Blood Diamonds? Nigga <laughs> so <far>, <laughs> had them kids out there with AK, boy. I said, yeah, 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 he learning. <laughs> That's a great observation. When you play not to lose, you usually don't win. You see, I'm talking about Blood Diamond. Boy, when he, they took his son and turned his son to a gangster. Boy, listen here. with the football as we get your reset and let's see what they've come up with offensively after having time to talk it over buying time to his left and a flag comes in as that one falls incomplete well, let's see who this is on so he was past a lot of scrimmage when he threw it and as they say that's a no-no got to be able to understand where you are on the field and not cross the line before throwing the ball downfield. <laughs> I mean, I mean, they say nothing, bro. <laughs> he hot now. He hot now. <laughs> hey, at least you a shout out, boy. <laughs> I'm like, boy, you get your ass beat. <laughs> Who you playing, Murray? No, not at all. I did have a coach explain to me years ago that for some teams, that's what they have to do with pass protection and their line blocking. But to me, it seems silly. Yeah, well, they are silly and it leads to a play action sack. Uh-oh. Why you do this, bro? Why you do this, bro? Oh. Leave that land alone about man, boy. <laughs> Let's go. Oh, how he trash. How he trash. Oh. 
how 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 he trash then? But if you was doing it, you would say your defense snapping. Bro, Barry, we just asking, bro. You just be, this man be snapping, bro. Nah, bro, cause it ain't, it ain't many times we can say, hey, Barry, you get your ass whoop. <laughs> This man, this man here the worst. Oh my God! I asked one question too. Oh, I don't care, Barry. Don't care about talking about it. I just asked how he trash. We all get our ass whooped. But Barry can't get his ass whooped. Shit. We sure did. <laughs> say what you want to say, Barry. Say what you want to say. <laughs> say what you want to say, Barry. Say what you want to say. Y'all niggas can't beat me. Nice gains. That one for 14 yards and another first. That boy Vari boy. He said, What you mean? Like, bro, we not watching the game. <laughs> That's what they're going for on first and goal. They'll run here with Laird. He takes it across. Bruh. No. <laughs> this man Kwame too funny. Wow. He, he outside of Philly, bro. He's not in Philly. I'm, I'm going to take him. That'll be taken about a yard deep. Now on the return. Oh, no. The ball is loose. And a penalty marker's down on the field. And they might be backing up a bit here to start the drive. So they elect to decline it. And why not? Just go ahead and let the play stand, and they'll take that. Yes, they do. Now they'll look to throw. Looking in zone, but it's incomplete. Devontae Parker, the intended receiver. That'll bring up second down. An incomplete pass on first down. That leads to a second and ten. Looks like he'll throw here. And oh, it'll be intercepted. Picked up by J.C. Jackson. The Patriots take over first and ten at their own 20-yard line. First down as they begin the drive. Well, this is just an exercise in futility. Do you, do you even bother running a play here offensively? I wouldn't because now is not going to erase what's happened during the game. And, oh, a crusher there as it's intercepted. 
Picked off near the 29. And that is going to seal this victory as time runs out. So a victory here for the Miami Dolphins. And with that, our journey begins, Charles. Week one in the books. It's going to be a great season. Oh, man, so much to look forward to. Isn't it nice to get a really good game right out of the gate? Preseason behind us. All these games count now, don't they? Yeah, this is the exciting time with just one week gone and plenty of weeks to come. So for the Dolphins, hey, you get a win, you get it on the road. You can't ask for much more than that to start the year. And they'll head back home next week to take on the Buffalo Bills. Meanwhile, for the Patriots, they obviously fall to 0-1 with the defeat. And they'll be on the road next week as they get a date with the Seahawks in Seattle. So for our entire crew, alongside Charles Davis, I'm Brandon Gordon. Thanks for watching, everybody. We'll see you next time. Twelve nineteen. Plenty of time. Plenty of time. <laughs> And my ticket better and my ticket better go in too. <laughs> hey, hey, hey Kwame, that boy gonna come out of Miami talking different. I'm, I'm as soon as I sign on, as soon as I sign on, he gonna say, Power Rose, you good? All right. Yeah, you gonna say you good? Cause I ain't got nothing on me, bro. I ain't got nothing on me. I get it to I get it to you as soon as I can. <laughs> You on your way. You, you on your way. No, I'm just telling. I'm t what? I'm gonna tell you this right now. Philly ain't nothing but Muslims. They don't believe in God. They believe in Allah. You took Indy with that uh, plus six. What you took with the Ram Seattle again? I'm saying you ain't take. I'm saying I might just money line Seattle. I like you like Milwaukee. You like Milwaukee with that twelve and a half or seven at the half? 
You like them to beat Cleveland by 12 and a half? Think ahead with them. I think I'm going to take Milwaukee with that 12. I think they'll blow them out. All right. That shit was funny when they put her on the Animaniacs intro. That shit had me dying. You took Josh Allen under and digs over. Ooh. Russell Wilson under two, right? Yeah. <laughs> He ain't gotta tell him shit. <laughs> he gonna come to the he gonna come to the sideline and say, "I know, coach. I know, <laughs> I know." No, they didn't. Questionable. Yeah, that inactive don't come out till three o'clock neither. Damn. It should have just dropped. I ain't even look. All right, hold on. I'm, yeah, I'm finna take uh, I'm taking that Josh Allen shit off. I ain't finna play with him. I might, I might take him over, bro.
Yeah. What you doing, boy? I don't know, boy, bro. You don't want to do yourself. I have nothing to do. So I just find a way to enjoy myself. Yeah. 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 You like Colts and Buffalo to go under 50? They ain't play this year? You know that? That's dead. Why? Why because it's my PlayStation. It's my PlayStation. I don't know why you think you can play when I'm not playing. It's not both ours. It's mine. You the only person that don't share shit, but now you're in a situation you want somebody to share. I just, I'm going to tear off shit with him. Uh, River, Rivers ain't been throwing a, for a lot of yards lately. Yeah, I might take him. I might take him under and keep Josh Allen off. In a couple weeks. No, no, no. I'm thinking about it. I'm thinking about it. But I'm gonna make it just for me. I'm gonna make it. What you want to do? Because you still on punishment. But I don't think you should be on punishment from four years. I've been punishment for almost two months now. Well, I've been watching you probably four years. I think you need your two years. I took Logan Thomas to go over. They tight end for the uh, Redskins because I saw Alex Smith throw to. I know that shit at nine now. What you're doing right now is I'm taking all that nine. I'm taking, I'm taking all of it. I don't give a fuck how, how much it go up. That's it. You were disrespectful more than one time. I ain't gonna play with my dog Brady like that. Like right now. There's no point in this conversation. We've had many conversations. I don't give a fuck no more. I don't give a fuck no more. You are not good. No, when I got my phone back the second time. What you're talking about is irrelevant. It doesn't matter. I'm going to give you a phone to talk to your friends and your friends only. Nothing extra. And so I can trust you. Because you lie. I just want to do it more. I mean, how can you trust me with my phone? What can I do with my phone? You got to fuck around and do it. No. Then you leave me You think Josh Allen going to run the ball a little bit today? Josh Allen? So, okay, so hold on. Oh, yeah. So you, so you like Josh Allen to rush over thirty-one yards? I know where your hair needs, not you. But I can't. It's passing at three hundred. Stop talking, Jameer. That is moose. All right, I'm gonna go with Joe. I'm gonna go with Josh Allen Russia. It's probably in that glass you left open. That glass you left open? Stand in the bathroom, figure out what glass is that's open. See how you said that because you're trying to be funny? That's disrespectful. Yeah, I, I got Singletary going over on mine. You ain't spiting me, you spiting yourself because you're spending your time in the bathroom. I ain't in the bathroom. I know you can clearly see that bottle in that glass. I ain't put him on there. Oh. I didn't even you want to be an idiot standing in the bathroom? You ain't bothering me. You swear you be spiting me, but you don't. It's amazing how you found it, though. You know what? 
So for instance, when Mesha showed the big ass piece to Hope, right? And that piece is all real, right? Because he, he was questionable, <laughs> but he playing. Dicks. Yeah. I mean, DK was getting open a little bit, but he wasn't, like, taking off. I would go with Lockett, if anything. I might take Lockett over. I'll just send it to you. So well, I'll be right back. Yeah. <laughs> no. 